Wednesday, September 8th. I'm Allie Hoxie. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Families in Flat Rock who have been forced out of their homes had a chance to be heard last night as they continue to look for answers. Many people say they're being kept in the dark about the cleanup efforts from both Ford and the state. Another meeting is set to take place tonight. Representatives from Ford, the Michigan Department of Environment, Great Lakes and Energy and the EPA have been invited. A garbage truck in Sterling Heights has crashed into a building near the northbound lanes of Mound Road, just north of 15 Mile. It appears the truck was southbound, then crossed the median before hitting the building. Several marijuana plants were seen inside that building. The battalion chief from Sterling Heights Fire Department says it is an illegal grow operation. Henry Ford Health System is facing a lawsuit filed by dozens of its employees. The employees say the system's requirement that they receive a COVID-19 vaccine is unconstitutional. The workers also filed a motion for a temporary restraining order to bar Henry Ford from implementing the mandate pending the outcome of the lawsuit. Highs in the upper 70s today, mostly sunny, a low chance of a stray shower in the afternoon today and again tomorrow afternoon, but it's going to be cool with low humidity. High of 78 today, just 72 degrees tomorrow, 75 Friday, and then we'll be back into the lower 80s this weekend starting Saturday.